Hey, what's up everybody? It's Neil here with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to show you how to scroll pages using the volume buttons on your Android device. So it's pretty easy and extremely useful while you're scrolling a page on, let's say, Chrome. Instead of actually touching the screen, you can actually use the volume keys to go up or down. Uh, I haven't done it yet, but I'm going to show you how. So the first thing you need to make sure that you have done is that your device is rooted and also running exposed framework. For those two guides, make sure you check out this guide on GadgetHacks.com. Once you're rooted and you have exposed framework, enter exposed, and you're just going to do a quick search, um, but it's already up here actually. It's called X up down. So you'll just tap on it and you'll install it. Once you install it, make sure you properly enable it by going to your modules, locating the module. X up down, so check it, then you go back into framework, and you'll do a soft reboot, and that'll actually activate it. Now, once your device reboots, you're going to go back into your app drawer and go into the interface of the module called X up down. So you go into here, it'll load all your applications, and all you have to do is check the application you want this function to work in. So let's go all the way down, let's have this in Chrome. Now it won't work in every single application as a developer mentioned, so don't be surprised if it doesn't work in something you chose, but it does work in Chrome which is convenient while you're reading an article or scrolling a page. So I'm gonna make sure I exit the app that I just enabled, and then I'll go into it. Now all I have to do is use the volume keys next to my thumb, and I can scroll, and it'll actually scroll a whole page length. So you see right here, take a look at that bottom image. If I scroll down, the rest of it's right up top. So just be sure to note that. Now you may be wondering, how do you adjust the volume now that this is actually active? All you have to do is pull down the notification tray, and you can actually adjust the volume now. So it's pretty simple and extremely useful, especially for those long articles. So definitely check out the full guide on GadgetX.com, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for some more awesome Gadget Hack videos. Thanks, guys.